So, with Pompey winning 3-0 and Manuga getting his first professional Portsmouth goal, they move on to the third round of the Papa John's Trophy. Who will they get in tomorrow's draw? Now, let's get straight into the match reaction. So, let's begin the match reaction talking about Cheltenham. Cheltenham did not create many chances. They didn't look very dangerous at all. It sounded like it was all Pompey in the full 90 minutes. And we go we score some we score three very good goals. First goal scored by Manuga in the fifteenth minute. And it was great for him to get his first Portsmouth goal. And it was a very good goal as well. Then we go get another goal in the twenty ninth minute, scored by Geordie Hewilla getting his second Portsmouth goal and another great finish by him. And, yep, 2-0 at half-time and it was going great for Portsmouth and Kenny Jackett's team. As you can see, we've got a different background to today. Go subscribe to my YouTube channel. So, um, yep, then five minutes after... Half time, it goes 3 0 Pompey, scored by Geordie Huwula once again to get grab his third Portsmouth goal in a Pompey shirt. So it's now on to Saturday against Ipswich Town. It's going to be a tough, tough performance for Portsmouth and Ipswich, both fighting for three points, both fighting to go up the league to get automatic promotion and move into the championship. Both teams want to go up there. I think everyone wants to be in that league. Sec England second division. So Cheltenham, yeah, they didn't play as well. I don't think they wanted to be in the competition. Pompey still having to play Salford from last season's Leasing.com trophy when Pompey beat Exeter 3 2 to move on to the final to play against Newport County. Is it Salford? New, yeah, Newport County or Salford, and Salford, Salford won on penalties. So, still having to play, and I think what's going to happen is they will might have to play it behind closed doors. So I think they're waiting for it to go back to normal, but we're going to have to wait a very, very long time for that to happen. So, I watched the highlights this morning, and it looked like we dominated the whole 90 minutes in those both, sec the first half and the second half, and we definitely deserved to go through. So, obviously, I've, I've already said, third round draw tomorrow... Don't, didn't say what time, but yeah, we'll just see who we get and we'll probably go through again. And maybe I just think we're going to win it. So, before we continue, here are yesterday's results. Do you want to read them? But yeah, I am. Um, yeah, I know it's only a small little cup, but you want to win it, you know. Obviously, we've got the FA Cup coming up as well in January. We have Bristol City. I reckon we can win that game. If K Jacket plays the right team, I reckon it'll be on BBC, BBC iPlayer. Because both of our first two FA Cup games have been on telly, so I reckon that will be on telly as well. So, then, yeah, so two goal scorers. George Hewilla getting two goals and Manuga getting his first Portsmouth goal so I'm very proud for him and he sounds like a very good player so does Geordie Hewilla with that great goal in the FA Cup which was a 6-1 win against Kingsling Town at Fratton Park 
I was trying to sort out my life, do enable live streaming, but I don't know why it wasn't letting me. I would have gone and do a live stream for one of the games this weekend in the Premier League. Obviously, we got Man City versus Manchester United, which will be a cracking of a game. We love the derbies. We love derbies like Pompey versus Southampton, Manchester United versus Man City. It's brilliant. I love watching derbies. We'll see what happened between Man City and Manchester United this weekend. With, I know, yeah, but let's carry on with that. With Cheltenham versus Portsmouth. So, Pompey go through. Cheltenham out of the second round. Also, you have the group stages first. And then you go into, you know, the rounds. But I'm very excited for what's going to happen in the FA Cup third round. I reckon we can go through and hopefully get a Premier League team and be on telly and get a lot of money from it, which would be good. And hopefully Pompey can go up to the Championship this season. And yeah, that's all I've got to say. Well done to Manuga once uh, again for grabbing his first support with goal. Very proud for him. And hope he probably sounded very happy about it. So well done to Manuga and well done to George he would have for scoring three ports of goals at the moment. So we now obviously got Saturday coming with Zipswitch, which would be a tough of a game. I think I might just do a match reaction again for that. And then I will be doing a preview. Don't you worry, I might do a preview for Zipswitch. I don't know. Okay, just wait and see for that. But I definitely will be doing a preview for Hull City versus Portsmouth live on Sky Sports. 8 o'clock kickoff, I think. Anyway, but that is it for me. Ooh. That is it for me. Thank you very much for watching. Drop a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, share this video. And I will see you all in my next YouTube video. Peace out.